opening with the king's pawn controls the center and opens up the light squared bishop and queen, often leading to sharp games. e5 is a common response that establishes a presence in the center, controls d4, and opens up the queen and dark squared bishop. nf3 develops the knight toward the center, attacks the e5 pawn, and prepares to castle. nc6 develops the knight toward the center, protects the pawn on e5, and eyes the d4 square. The Rui Lopez opening develops the bishop to immediately attack the knight on c6, the lone defender of the e5 pawn. A6 forces the bishop to decide, exchange or retreat. BA4 safely retreats the bishop while keeping pressure on the knight. NF6 attacks the undefended e4 pawn and develops the knight at the same time. Castling gets the king out of the center and prepares to develop the rook to e1. B5 gains space on the queen side and threatens the bishop on a 4. BB3 retreats the bishop to a more active square. BB7 puts the bishop on the long diagonal in a move called a fianchetto. D3 supports the e4 pawn and allows the dark squared bishop to develop. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is the last book move. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is good. This defends a bishop that was under attack and had no defenders. It is good. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent avoids some of the attacking associated with opposite side castling. It is good. This activates a queen by developing it off of its starting square. It is good. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is excellent. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. It is good. This activates a rook by developing it off of its starting square. It is excellent. This protects the attacked pawn. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to increase a bishop's scope by moving it to a better square. It is an inaccuracy. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. It is best. This reveals an attack on a knight. It is best. This defends a knight that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This develops a rook off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is excellent. This ignores an opportunity to centralize a knight so it controls more squares. It is an inaccuracy. A very strong play. It is excellent. This adds pressure by pinning a knight. It is excellent. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. Very precise. It is best. This move puts the pawn on a safer square. It is best. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This moves the knight to safety. It is best. This misses an opportunity to defend a pawn that was under attack. This allows the opponent to kick a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This blocks the attack on a rook that could have been captured. It is best. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. This ignores an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is a mistake. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is a miss. This is a fair move. It is good. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is excellent. This ignores an opportunity to move a knight to safety. It is a mistake. There was only one good move there. It is a miss. The game was close to balanced, but now black is worse. It is a miss. This allows the knight to control more squares. It is best. 
This ignores an opportunity to challenge the opposing rook for the open file. It is a mistake. This misses a great but hard to find move. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it? It is a miss. This is the strongest option. It is best. There was only one good move in that position. This ignores an opportunity to offer an equal trade of pieces. It is a mistake. This overlooks a better way to recapture a piece. It is a miss. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. This threatens to win material. It is an inaccuracy. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is good. This wins time by threatening a bishop and forcing it to move away. It is best. There was only one good move there. This overlooks an opportunity to offer an equal trade of pieces. It is a mistake. This ignores an opportunity to double rooks on a single file. It is an inaccuracy. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. This permits the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a queen. It is an inaccuracy. This wins a tempo by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. It is best. This moves the queen to safety. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This allows the opponent to reveal an attack on a queen. It is a mistake. This reveals an attack on a queen. It is best. This is an equal trade. This is the only good move. It is best. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. Recaptures. It is best. The knight now occupies an outpost, a secure square in the opponent's territory. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is best. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. That was a truly amazing move. This is the only good move. It is brilliant. This places a rook on the 7th rank, activating the rook and restricting the opponent's king. It is best. This misses a great but hard to find move. It is a blunder. This wins a knight. This took advantage of a mistake and white now has a winning advantage. It is a great move. This allows a forced checkmate. This threatens to win a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This is the way to win a rook. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed black in that one. The opening was balanced. White was a cut above black in the middle game. 